people, this is Bonjour. We're in Valencia here. We're going to try some Peruvian food, some chaufa. Finally, this is real chaufa. Last time we tried, we ended up in an Asian restaurant that served chalofen, which honestly wasn't a disappointment at all. It was pretty good, but I'm waiting for Mickey now. She just went up to get the USB card reader. I bought one here, it doesn't work. So I have to bring it back and get a new one, da 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 da. Hate when that stuff happens because I got to reformat my, um, my GoPro. And then I gotta put a new update on it. So, cause it's kind of freezing and stuff. So we need to get that cleared off. But we're going to catch a beer at a local pub. We don't know where. I think we're going to the Queen Square over there. Cause that's like one of our favorite places here in Valencia. And then we're going down the street over here. Right down there, go two blocks to grab some chaufa. Hopefully they have some good Peruvian flute and some uh, ceviche. Ceviche and chaufa, most likely she loves ceviche. So we're here in Valencia. We're gonna try to do it. Click like, subscribe, and share. And remember, always comment if you want to help us out. Donate to the PayPal at thisisbonjo at gmail.com. We're at La Teresa, first stop of the night, right here. It's beautiful, we're stopping in for a quick tapas before we go for our meal, having a beer. Thank you, my son. I think I'm having a 1906. It's uh, the same company as Estrella Galicia. <laughs> and uh, she's having a coffee. It's nighttime, yes, it's almost eight. But we're gonna have patata bravas because it's our last time probably gonna have them then. So we're out here. We're, we're actually down the street from Chispa Orda, the place that gave me a free $20 on New Year's and free two beers. Awesome place, I recommend it. The question is, why ain't I going back there today? I think I'd have to pay, because the second time I walked by, I asked them how much a beer was. They said six euros. Six euros, what are we talking about, Chispa Oro? What happened to the free $20 and free two beers? Right, Mickey? I want it also. Are you having a, are you gonna have a patata bravas or no? Of course I have to try them. You have to try them? I have to try them. Why? Qu quality testing. So he asked me if I wanted a double or a pinta. What? This is smaller than the double or the double's bigger? I don't know. This is pretty big, no? I think it's normal. I think the double is the big, big jar. Oh, the big, like the big, big jar. Yeah, see, this is a big one, huh? I think it's good. Do you, do you want a bigger? Yeah. No, I like it. This is a huge beer. I wanted a small one, to be honest. I'm feeling this. Hey. Mmm. Mm. Well, this is always good. Nice little beer. Everybody probably thinks I drink all day. You do. Ah, come on. We drink every time the camera's on for the camera. For the camera. Enzo with his pint of strawberries again. As soon as he sees this store, there's a store on the way to this Queen um, Queen Square. And it's called Ahmed's Fruits, I guess. I think it's called the fruit store, Ahmed's Fruits. And as soon as he sees this place, he starts crying like, ah, because he knows where his strawberries are. 150, it's the cheapest, I swear to you, that Ahmed's strawberries, cheapest you'll ever find here in Valencia. Everywhere else is like six euros, right? Yeah, we bought the five euros. I mean, it was bigger than this, but it was five euros. Yeah, like a few bigger, not that much bigger. Yeah, like geez, 150 is a fair price, but five euros is crazy. Man. Look at this guy, he's hypnotized by the fire. Well, now he'd moved, but Enzo, look at this guy, he dropped all the strawberries. There's the show, the patata bravas, look at that. Wow. Let's dig in here. Uh -oh. There goes Enzo. Enzo, you want papita? Some ketchup? Papita? Some aioli sauce? Mm. Are they hot? Yeah. 
That goes Enzo. He's going to the next bar. But here. You want me to go? Come here. Have Papa. Here. Mama said you have to eat. She will eat. Mm, I love alioli. Mm. Maybe they are good, huh? Oh. I don't think we have time. <sighs> but let's dig into these uh, patas and ramas. They're the best one that we. Eat. You think so? I like it at the, the place beside La Bucaria. That place was good, that old man. Mm. That old man that went to Argentina. Mm. But these are good. We don't even know how much does it cost, do we? No. <laughs> it doesn't matter, does it? It better be if we don't know. Mm. Look at that. They're a little bit... They have spices like Cajun spice or something on it. Plus the ketchup, plus aioli, eh? Mmm. Aioli tastes like mayonnaise, no? It's mayonnaise with garlic. Mmm. And olive oil or no? Yeah. It's good. No mayonnaise. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> he's going, he's, he's joining. He just says, screw this, I'm joining. He believes in this movement. What do they say? The last name of somebody, they yeah. are the same shit. Ah, this is the place, Ahmed's Frutas and Veduras. This is the place Enzo always points to and he's like, I need a strawberry package. This is the second time tonight. And look at him, he's going nuts for another pack of strawberries. Ahmed's fruits, huh? Beautiful. Did you grab a strawberry? No, I didn't. No, but this is it right here. This is a strawberry pack. 150, see? 150, six euros for the huge pack. So it's a really good deal. restaurant is Inca. What's it Inca called? Bar. Inca Bar. And you can see the Inca tribe behind you with the Inca mountains and it's good maybe they, yeah maybe they have the Inca Cola. Who knows? Could be crazy right? Yeah it could be. But yes it's not so busy yet. No it's early for everybody. It's early, yeah. So it's nice. good we get to sit wherever we want. Yeah. Oh we're at the Inca Bar we're gonna try some uh, chalfa maybe. Yeah. Chalfa yeah? Chafa? Chafa. Let's check this. Uh, you want here? Yeah, for sure. Una cerveza para él. Do they have a? Do they have a Peruvian beer? Peruvian. Yeah. Yes. Esta para él. Peruvian beer. We have to have Peruvian beer at a Peruvian restaurant. Perfect. I'll get the green one. Yes, yeah. Si tenés sin alcohol. Yeah, the Peruvian beer. Look at this menu. That's beautiful. Isn't it? Bueno, Rattler. The Rattler is perfect. 
Ooh, chalfa arroz. It's perfect. Where is my chalfa? Chalfa marisco. Quisiera, that one is amazing. I like the chalfa with chicken and all that stuff. That's a good chalfa. Are you getting, uh, what are you getting? Ceviche, probably? Look at all these menus. Oh, look at this. My first. My first Peruvian, Peruvian beer. beer. Look at this, Pilsen. I don't even have to go to Peruvia. Peru, Peruvia. <laughs> oh. well, that's a good beer. You like it? I have a Rattler. You got a Rattler. So how many percent? You got a little, two percent. Ooh. Mama's getting nasty tonight. What is this? Anticuchos. What's anticuchos? Cancha. Gancha. <laughs> oh, yeah. yes, I remember this, huh? Yeah. It's like, um, what do you call that again? Uh, corn. corn. Yeah, it's like, Pretty healthy? Maiz tostado. Maiz yeah. tostado. It's a toasted. Yeah, it's like their version of peanuts it's with beer. Look at that. Beef salad. Beef salad. Loma, yeah, beef salad, eh? I was just looking at that. You want beef salad? This is steamed potato. Ooh, mama is feeling good today. Eh? Or, uh, lomo saltado. Lomo saltado. Chunks of beef with onions, tomatoes, Peruvian seasoning, fried mm. potatoes with white rice, kiko sauce, and fried egg. How does he feel about it? It's the best? It's or our chalfa is the best, huh? No, chalfa is the best. This guy's going crazy. We just had a blackout at the restaurant. I can't see you at all. <laughs> but we don't know what happened. One minute yeah, we're playing music. Yeah, electricity's out of here, son. Mm. Maybe it's only an Inca Cola. I mean, an uh, Inca beer. Inca beer. That's it. <laughs> oh. We're back. The lights are back. Let's go. Another, give me another beer. Yeah. Look at this, son. I can't wait to dive into this. This is beautiful. Look at this. Actually, I never had a chalfa with salt chicha. But look at this. It's beautiful, isn't it? Enzo's gonna be eating good tonight. Look at this. Wow. <laughs> look at that. Beautiful. Beautiful, isn't it? Doesn't that one look good? And it's so big. Mmm, that's what she said. Look at her meat salad, her beef salad. Try that out. That looks honestly amazing. And these guys are loving it. These guys are partying back here. It's awesome. Good vibes here. What do you think? Everybody looks pretty happy here? Gracias. Ooh, look at that salsa picante, man. What? How is that? <laughs> it looks good. It's very soft, the meat, and also How? the the taste. It's not. I don't know what is the sauce that they have here, yeah. but it's not too strong, you know. So. How's the rice? The rice is okay. I'm not a big fan of rice. But it's good, huh? Correct. Try that, huh? Ooh. Mm. There we go. It's good, eh? Let me try this chow pa. This is what we've been waiting for, eh? Let's try this. We'll try some uh, some hot sauce, of course, of course, of course. We gotta always have hot sauce. Let's try this. Mmm. Mm. The other chunk I had 
I've never had like salchicha <clears throat> in it, but to be honest, it's not that bad. It's pretty good this one. You wanna try it? Sure. And the hot sauce is actually hot. I'm not even gonna lie. Let's try it. Let's see that. What do you think about that chow pot? That's a good chow pot, eh? It's a good one. It's I'm a so good. fond of chow pot. What was the name of the original one? Chow la fan. Chow la fan. And that guy was serious about Chow La Fan. Yes, this is original. Sure, buddy, we don't care. We just want some Chow La Fan. Mmm. This mm. is so good. I'm gonna mix all the hot sauce in because it honestly tastes freaking good. Mmm. It's a mixture of egg, chicken, salt, salchicha, like salt, I mean sausages, um, green onions, and soy sauce. It has to be pretty easy to make, but when I make it, it doesn't taste like this. <laughs> it tastes different. Mmm. So there's Bar Inca. We are just at Bar Inca. They have Inca Cola, Inca Beer, Inca Food. It's a great Peruvian restaurant. We didn't try the ceviche this time because Mickey wanted to try something different for the camera. How much did it come to? No way, that's crazy. That's pretty crazy actually. So if you want to take the food that you just paid for, you gotta pay an extra euro. What? Yes, we had you for the chopper work. <laughs> and they never but, but I'll tell you this, the guy was pretty good. It was good vibes. And it was fun. Like they were all dancing and you can hear the guy singing and everything. But I mean there's the chofo with hot dogs in it is pretty wild, eh? Yes, I honestly thought that it wasn't so much taste. No? But I don't know why I love the other one in the Bar Valencia. The Chau La Fan. That was amazing. And it was, was way amazing. cheaper. Yes. And it was way cheaper, so. Yes, way cheaper. And. Was this one worth it? I liked it, but she doesn't seem like she likes it. Everybody has different tastes. Different strokes for different folks, right people? I like it, sometimes Mickey doesn't like it. I don't like it, Mickey likes it. That's the way it works, right? You just gotta come here and try it on your own. That's the whole point of this. A mango. Let's go, it's done. Thanks for watching people. This is Bunjo. Click like, subscribe, and share. But we just tried some Peruvian food here in Valencia. It was a little different from the one that was closer to the border of Peru in Argentina. In Argentina, in Cordoba Capital. That one was, blew my mind. After I had that, I had to eat it every single day. But this one, would I go back? I don't know. I don't know. There's so many options here. I don't think so. I don't think I'd go back, but it wasn't bad.